Good day, happy travelers. Vacation travel hacks here with Seven Continents Travel Agency. Today, we're talking about shore excursions to take in Aruba when you are traveling on Carnival Cruise Line. So if you're watching this video, you're either thinking about traveling on Carnival going to Aruba, or you are, in fact, booked with Carnival Cruise Lines going to Aruba. And this video is perfect for you because, well, we show you some of your options there. Carnival has a lot of great options. Uh, as a matter of fact, when my family went in there, we did three different shore excursions because my group of 12 split into three different groups. I, of course, took part in snorkeling. That's my passion. But my dad was in the Navy, and he is not a big fan of going into the water. Does not mind being on a cruise ship, but he just doesn't like going into the water. So let's hop into this, show you some of your shore excursion options that exist for Aruba. So the first one, actually the, the, the one that we did, catamaran sail and snorkel. You get off the boat, you walk a short distance to the, uh, the, the pier here, you hop on a different boat, and they take you out to go, well, sailing and snorkeling. Very scenic, a uh, great tour of the island. You head up towards uh, the, the California lighthouse, and uh, the, the water is clear. Noteworthy, that I did this in spring break, April, uh, noteworthy that the water was colder in Aruba. And I'm talking like oof, 70, like when you jump into the water and your soul leaves you kind of cold. I, I didn't expect that. I, I, I didn't expect that. But uh, it, and then we went on down to uh, Curacao and the water was, well, warmer. And that's, uh, that's worth noting here. But we're talking about Aruba. Nice four-hour excursion, pretty reasonably priced, uh, $70 kids. My, my kid is almost 13, so we're enjoying these $10 savings uh, while we can. But it shows you where it stops. The uh, the, the shipwreck is pretty cool. Uh, sea turtles kind of swimming in and out of it. Uh, and then the, the beach here at Boca Catalina. Uh, it, was, it was a really, really good experience. Uh, the reviews, uh, they say it could have been much better. And uh, it's a short kite. It was. That's almost exactly. It's almost like I wrote that review. Uh, but in terms of fun, they said it wasn't fun. Second dive is the wreck. It, the water. <clears throat> mm, listen, the the it's a little further out where the ship sunk. Uh, the water wasn't calm. There was a lot of undertow. So I, I could see why. Uh, it, <laughs> I could see why there, there would be some feedback. But there was a lot of people. All There was a bunch of other tours. You're not the only... Uh, if you're the only cruise ship, you're definitely, there, there's still about eight other tours that go here. So if, anyway, if you're into snorkeling, I recommend snorkeling. If you're like, whoa, 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 hey, wait a minute, I'm not into snorkeling. I want to, uh, to do something else. Well, what about driving on a, a bus for a little bit? $70 a person, uh, the no kids price, because this isn't a kid's activity. This person has their tongue out. They, they have, uh, uh, rattles that they're shaking. I don't know the name of that, but they're, they're shaking some rattles. You just drive around and you celebrate stops, take you to sites, you get your pictures and uh, you, you can buy food if you want. And then uh, there, there's there's beverages to consume. And it is uh, what we call in Nashville, a party bus. So if that's for you, ta-da, you're having a, a, a little bit of fun there. Want to learn how to do uh, scuba diving? Well, Aruba is, well, if not only for that shipwreck. Uh, I couldn't, it was, I don't know, maybe 20 feet uh, below. But there's a, a, a beginner uh, scuba dive. So if this is more your speed, uh, they, they kind of go into the experience. Uh, what's included, you get trained, you get scuba gear. So if this is a, a world that a lot of people enjoy scuba diving. So if this is what you're thinking about doing, this is, this is, this is great. Uh, and, uh, overwhelmed. So let's read some of the, uh, uh, and, uh, feedback here. Felt pretty confident. Lady instructor wanted to see if I could do it. Push. <laughs> Uh, it reminds me of the time that I was learning to ride my bike. And, uh, well, uh, it looks like this person had a very similar experience. Otherwise, uh, 24 reviews uh, are, are five stars. So that is uh, fantastic. Uh, pretty, I mean, pretty good reviews. But otherwise, you can go around the beach on a, a UTV. And then there's lots of different uh, buses, uh, party buses. Uh, the, then there's the Sea and Sea Island tour by bus. So you drive around the bus, then you go uh, under the semi-submarine for a little bit. 
uh, Eagle Beach and Discover Aruba. This is the tour that my parents did. It takes you to a lot of the, the highlights, uh, pretty reasonably priced. And again, and it, for me, anything under hundred bucks per person is what I consider reasonable. Uh, but it takes you, here's the, the lighthouse. There's the, the bus, it's air conditioned. And uh, that's uh, what why my parents, here, hey, uh, this would be my dad. Hey, look at that sand, look at that water. Don't want to be in it. Uh, and then they got pictures of this uh, this bridge here. Uh, so yeah, it's uh, if you want to see the sites guided tour, always uh, always a lot of fun, and uh, they they really enjoy this. And I hope they uh, get to do it again because we are going back there uh, with with Carnival next November. And maybe you want to do uh, snorkel and drinks. Go go to the cave and do some snorkeling. What about four by four caves and snorkeling? You can mix it up. Uh, then what if you're, what if you don't want to be a beginner uh, scuba, you want to be a certified two tank scuba. Uh, then you got the sunset cocktail and cruise, uh, the Aruba ports, a lot of them are later, late, later evening during sunset. So if you want some great pictures, certainly something to, uh, to consider. It's not the super long, uh, excursion. I thought it was pretty quick. Uh, two hours, yeah. So versus a four hour where you're out and about, this is just during the sunset. Get you back on there because the boat leaves a shortly after sunset. Uh, might it might impact your MDR, but if you have any time dining with Carnival, it will not impact your MDR because you dine whenever you want to dine. Uh, my brother also did the helmet dive in a different port, but he he recommended it. It's pretty cool. Uh, pretty cool experience. Uh, I guess the feedback was it went by pretty pretty quick, but for $200 a person, I don't call this a relatively uh, cheap excursion, but it is six hours, and uh, they, they got a Jeep under there for you. It's highly re related, uh, rated, but it has 10 reviews, so we'll, we'll head on down. So what do you get? Snorkel gear, helmet dive, but I mean, there's food, open bar, open Caribbean bar, so that means rum in my world. That does not mean Jack Daniels, access to aqua parks. And that uh, actually, that in and of itself would justify. Uh, water park was closed <laughs> four years ago. Uh, well, that's 2019, pre-COVID. Uh, the, the fun water park is closed and being charged full price. That's why they got one star. Otherwise, it looks like a lot of people really enjoy this. And uh, six hours, I, I think you're getting your bang for your buck there. Uh, let's go on to the next page. And uh, more UTVs, scuba dives, more bus, uh, VIP schooner with uh, with meal. So you go out there in a boat. Uh, hey, this is like a sea bob. So you, you go under, it's like a jet ski, but it's underwater. Uh, the, those are always fun. And then, of course, you can do the uh, finish strong with an island tour. Again, pretty reasonably priced. I'm all, just in case my family doesn't want to do snorkeling. Eh, heck, we're, we're going to do snorkeling, but we'll show you this anyway. Three and a half hours, $65 per person, $55 for kids. And look at this. You go out, you get your selfies. Hey, look, I'm in Aruba. Look at this. You'll never believe it. Ta-da. Uh, <laughs> hey, look, a mountain. Some cactuses. Did you know there's cactuses in Aruba? I didn't believe until I see it. Look, a, a plane was here. I uh, can go to the cafe, take a picture of that. Look, an old car, more pictures. Hey, I'm by the water. Look, I'm by, by some birds. So there's, uh, uh, let's take a look at the reviews. 218 reviews, a little bit over four stars. And uh, the tour did take us to four locations. And a lot, a lot of feedback. When you're doing the Discover Tour, some people want more time in one spot, less time in another. Uh, some people do feel rushed. Uh, and they like this person who gave it four stars. Hey. Uh, they, we, we wanted to see the island and we did. I really enjoyed the taste of Aruba and would re recommend it to anyone who does not want to do a lot of walking. So there you go. Okay. I think that's, uh, that's fantastic. So that's what Carnival offers. Uh, but I also like to show what, uh, third parties offer, uh, just in case something sells out is not available and that happens. Uh, through the carnival provided options. And sometimes, you know, carnival is kind of the, the middleman. There. There's a little bit of a markup. And so you can save money here, but I have to give this preface like I do in all my, my speeches here. If you book third party uh, and something happens, you don't make it back to the ship, uh, you, you're you on your own. Uh, if something happens to you, you're at the mercy of that third party's insurance uh, program and their, whatever waiver they have. 
And uh, so there's there's risk, but you can save money. And a lot of people do this. So I like to show what's available. Similar options. So if you want to go around the island on uh, four wheels, you got some options there. Lots of bus options, more sunset sailing options. That's forty dollars per person cheaper there. Uh, snorkeling, uh, uh, snorkeling cruise. So actually, that looks similar to the, the boat that I took. It might, it might be. Well, heck, it might be. Uh, so more snorkeling, more snorkeling. Uh, so sixty dollars instead of uh, what, what was it? Sixty, uh, sixty-nine. So saving ten bucks. Didn't see too many horses on the beach. Uh, excursions. Look at that. You, you can uh, have a romantic moment on a horse on a beach in Aruba. Not too many people do that. Goes uh, private snorkeling. Uh, more four-wheel adventures. Uh, sea do. I've always wanted to do a jet ski. That that's just. I don't know how I've spent so much time in the Gulf of Mexico and the Caribbean and not done any jet skiing. I, I find it generally unacceptable. Parasailing uh, looks like a lot of fun. You get to parasail with a what is that, Mister Yuck sticker? It's uh, you know, hey, uh, Palm uh, de Palma. You know, I didn't see the the water park on the the Carnival Cruise uh, shore excursion option. Let me. Uh, let me go back. Let me go back a page because De Palma Island is a uh, a water park, and maybe it jump pages. Uh, sometimes when you look at the excursions, they kind of rearrange themselves. I don't know why, but I know that they do. Like uh, John is now up here. Uh, John Saki. Uh, here's the butterfly at Arashi, uh, Arashi in Eagle Beach. Banana bus to Eagle Beach if you just want to go to Eagle Beach is one of the more popular beaches. Here it is, De Palm Island. Uh, this right here, this this sells out, and it sells out pretty quickly. So if you want to do the uh, the Aqua Park and Buffet, if that's something you want to do. Uh, when we went, when we were going in April, we started out like eighty nine dollars, and I, I looked at it in December. I was like, ah, I'll just wait. Maybe I'll get some uh, Christmas money to throw at it. So in January, I go back in to look at it, and uh, the the price went up to like one twenty nine. I should have taken that as like limited availability because sometimes see where it says featured right here, it'll say limited availability. So uh, it didn't. And uh, I, I let it go another uh, couple weeks, and it just completely sold out. So that that is Aruba, and this this is the island of Aruba. Oh, you will park up here, and then as you leave, you'll have a, you'll leave at night. You'll get a nice view of the uh, the airplane. But Eagle Beach, the lighthouse is up this way. Most of your snorkeling is over here. You'll see all the resorts. So anyway, long story short. Uh, you're on a fantastic ship. You're probably on the, the horizon or the Mardi Gras, maybe the magic uh, or celebration. Celebration goes down here. One of the many ships. There's so many ships go to the Southern Caribbean and uh, it's a fantastic ship. Whatever one you go on is a, a fantastic ship with lots of entertainment. So I, I hope this uh, helps you in reviewing your options for shore excursions. And uh, they're, they're picked with your fun in mind. They don't just go out and say, you, you, and you. They, they look at their reviews. They make a contract. They, they were picked so that you have fun. That's the idea. So if it looked like something you would have fun, in my experience, everything that we picked that we would have fun with, uh, we, we had fun with. There was, you know. So that's that's the cool thing about it. So anyway, I hope you have a safe trip. And until my next video, take care.